team of Midwest United Juggalos. Yeah, yeah. For those who don't know, uh, I go by the name Bobby Blaze. I go by the name of Jiggy Fresh. And I'm Matt Murderous. Um, this is uh, what we call the Weekly Wicked Web Show, um, which is yeah. really just like a... Uh, a uh, Sometimes weekly, uh, occasional weekly web show uh, is is actually the more <clears throat> accurate name to it. But um, what we do this, uh, we do this like uh, every so often, every couple of weeks. We get together on our channel over at Midwest United Juggalo, and we do a, a, a little rundown of um, the underground news plus what we're up to. Oh yeah. Um, today is a very special edition. Because we're coming to you from yeah, super fucking special. Super special. Uh, a great way to start yeah. out to uh, 2019. Um, we're coming to you from Carnival Spirits YouTube channel. Wow, yeah, yeah. Yo. it's fucking different around here. A little bit, uh, little bit. but cool as fuck. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Uh, I dig the vibes. I dig yeah. the vibes. It's nice. It's um, nice. We've known Carnival Spirits for quite a while. Uh, I think they got to start around uh, a little after the first time that we started doing uh, right. MUJ. Uh, Beastmaster uh, has always been at least someone that we've known, uh, maybe not personally met, but have known through uh, uh, our website to their current mm -hmm. work now with um, Carnival Spirits. Um, he happened to reach out to us. Uh, and we got this shit going. Um, we you know, like, uh, fuck yeah. Fuck let's yeah. do it. We Family and not, not divided, yes. right? Starting exactly. fun off big time in 2019. Fun movement. Full effect. So super dope. Yeah, yeah. Shout, yeah. Out Dude, uh, so shout out to Beastmaster and then the Carnival Spirits for... Uh, for, yeah, yeah, for, for reaching out to us reaching on this, out, it, it's definitely a, a, a big thing, you know what I'm saying? And like, uh, for those of you guys who don't know um, our long-standing motto for us here at Midwest United Juggalos, uh, yeah. so it's always been something that we want to do is, uh, you know, bring the family together, uh, unite each other. So this is like, uh, you know, our first opportunity this year to really show that, you know, that's what we are all about here. Family United yeah, Not yeah. Divided. We don't talk, we don't just talk about it. We bees about it. Bees and about uh, it. it's still, it's dope to do this Juggalo takeover. Hell yeah, man. Um, exactly. Hell yeah, you know what I'm yeah. saying? Like, really, it, it felt weird all day. It felt different all day getting it ready is. for the shit, yeah, you know what I'm saying? Uh, we were hanging out right. earlier, <clears throat> and it felt different getting ready for this show because, <laughs> you know, we always do, we always have fun doing our, our weekly Wicked Web show, and we always uh, uh, are excited to do it and shit, right. but it just right. felt like, you know, even more cool because we have the opportunity to reach uh, a lot more homies, a lot more fam that might be interested in what we do. Um, so again, man, uh, big shout out to Carnival Spirits, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. We fucking appreciate y'all. Uh, we Thank hope you. to work with you guys even more. Um, we hope to be on your channel even more and, um, you know, support the shit out of them. And if you guys like what you see the rest of this show, go over here and like us, uh, follow us, uh, Midwest United Juggalo. Uh, ooh, excuse me. Or just look up uh, Team MUJ and you'll find us. Yep. Um, but really, man, uh, we're going to go ahead and do what we would normally do on our channel, uh, just a regular weekly Wicked Web show. Yeah, let's um, do it. We didn't feel like, you know, we wanted to waste a whole bunch of time on introduction and everything um, and go basically right into what we normally do. And that's, uh, you know, kind of cover this underground news type shit. Yeah. And uh, today, uh, we, were, we were like delivered a fucking bomb. All right. Straight bone. Straight so up. Stalness. Straight <clears throat> bone. Woo. What was that? We were talking about some things uh, a couple weeks ago, and we were like, uh, you know, Psychopathic said, or ICP said all these things at the gathering of things that they were going to do, and a whole bunch of them didn't come true. Uh, yeah. This was one of those things that was going to come true, and then it, did for it didn't. A few days? And it did for like a day or two, a couple days. It did for a couple days. Um, it does suck to announce here that the E and J tour has oh, been officially, officially canceled. canceled. <laughs> the fucking bone again, bro. Bone. Um, First we got bone in what? November? October? When uh, Fearless Fred was supposed to come out. Yeah, yeah. We're really going to get the bone. That's still coming out, but... He got the bone, though, because we were excited yeah, for we it. We were no excited for it. No more info, nothing happened. Uh, and and then, then this tour, like, see, that we're going to, like, resurrect everything, because they did let out those vinyls. They said yeah. they were going to. Yeah. But they were going to kind of, like, resurrect shit and uh, do this dope-ass set of tours. Fuck yeah. And the one that I was really looking forward to the most was E&J. Yeah. yeah, right. And uh, right, we got the right, news. Right. Um, news started coming I mean, in yesterday, right. uh, last night sometime that right. uh, the show or that a couple of shows had gotten canceled. Yeah, I saw. Started seeing notifications. Was like, oh man, I hope this is just some bullshit, bullshit ruse, <laughs> yeah. or just like a couple of days type thing. You know what I'm saying? Uh, but it turns out it was not just a couple of days thing. Uh, Esham was the first oh. to officially announce it today, uh, followed oh, by uh, ICP hours later. Um, shit, so, uh, um, uh, so we, uh, 
you know, we're bummed to announce Super that. Uh, we've been talking about it for a few weeks here in particular because we would be making the stop in Joliet on the 23rd. Um, but now uh, that it's been canceled, there will be no Razor show with the NJ on the 23rd. But uh, there is good in, uh, news in that, that we will be um, hooking back up with Razor. What's the date of that? The 31st the of... The 31st of... Uh, this month. Yeah, the so the first, the 31st day. of January, same place, um, but it'll be on the Shaggy 2 Dope Tour with Ouija Mac. DJ um, Clay and Bales also. Yeah, so I'm pretty so, excited about that be, uh, because we wanted dope. to see that anyway, you know what I'm saying? Um, but that's, you know, it's bummer news. Uh, I expect Brother, the EP, to be on Psychopathic <laughs> Merch within a week. Uh, to make the money back at least off of that. Right. Um, I don't know, though. Uh, it's definitely a bummer. I wanted to see E and J together in the same tour for a while. Um, there's always been that past bullshit. Yes. A lot of stuff, a lot of, uh, what you call it, beef yeah. and reconciliation back and forth all and the I, fucking time between them. But. And I don't know if, like, there's only been speculation right now, so there heard, hasn't been... What, what did you hear? I, I heard that, you know, there was... Uh, finally, Jay had a panic attack to... There were problems with the tour bus. Were the two speculations that I heard. Yeah, that's what I heard too. Ishan was rolling in a. It's wax. Keep getting it. Video. Okay. Yeah. I don't know, man. It's it's always speculation when it comes to that shit getting canceled. Oh shit! I originally heard something about Fago. You instantly called bullshit on that. Yeah. I had to, man. I mean, right. I'm I mean so it's, not really, it's not a clown. <laughs> show. It's not a clown show, so I mean, I'm, you can't throw <coughs> Fago if it's you know, just both clowns aren't there. But then I heard, right uh, I heard the van issue or whatever, <laughs> and I would have taken an Uber. Right. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Right. Uh, I heard van issue, uh, but then I also heard panic attack issue that somewhere someone's right. saying that Violent Jay had a panic attack on stage again last night, walked off. That's similar to what happened in Canada right. earlier, mm -hmm. later last year. Um, so we can all we can do is speculate right now, uh, as of course Psychopathic was the late ones on it to announce that the tour is over, um, and it is it's more of a bone to all ticket holders. I'm from what you said, uh, 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 they are honoring all tickets from the E&J show at the Two Dope, uh, fuck the fuck and all the Two Dope shows on Two Dope shows or every show that's <clears throat> been canceled. So well, and that was the thing the too. Is what was weird about the tour is. If they were worried about ticket sales, was that something else that I heard? Is that right. they kind of fucked themselves by doing. Shaggy and Jay come into the same place weeks like a week apart. Right. And in every place, that's how it is. Right. They're like a week yeah. apart. That's so fucking stupid. Like, why not just do the tour together, and do the fucking Jay and Shag's fucking speaker box love below tour? There you, go. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? And, yeah, you, you know, and do that because really they would have sold way more uh, tickets. Uh, way more merchandise and all that. They fucked themselves by doing it split like that. They yeah. could have done a split tour, but just done like a three-hour fucking maxi-ass tour, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, Which would dope. have been dope as fuck. Think about shit like that. You were booking, you booked Emerson as a week apart. Right. Uh, the Forge as a week apart. Mm -hmm. yeah. So either way, people were going to pick. You, Your fan base, you talk about your fan base being poor, then you're, they're going to have to pick, you, you know what I'm saying? You. One I was only, I was only for sure gonna go to two because I was getting paid to go to one. You know what I'm saying? Like that was like that made the other one like oh, okay. Well, yeah, I'll definitely go to the other one yeah. and spend the money that I'm I'll get paid to do this. You know, so, so you know, maybe now there's a chance you'll see it as at at two, uh, no two dope two, tours instead of two, just instead two, of just two one dope tour. two two dope tours, which is a tongue twister. We're two, good about, two dope two two we're, dope tongue twisting tours. We're good at tongue twisters here in uh, MUJ. If you guys, uh, for those who don't know, <laughs> that was gonna be the phrase of the day. Know. Every time we say for those of you who don't know, take a drink in this episode <laughs> because we're probably gonna say it a lot uh, to catch you guys to, to catch yeah, those who don't know up on these things that we're doing here. You know what I'm saying? I'll um, start. But that. Uh, it is a bummer, man, but there is always, you know, like, uh, instantly people came online talking shit. And it's a lot of the times it's the people who don't say anything good about what Psychopathic's done over the last however many months or all the cool things that they've done. But as soon as, oh, as soon as they fuck up, there they are. As soon as the bone comes. Yeah, as soon as the bone comes. Oh, yeah, it is, dude. It's roaches in the darkness, bro. They never fucking, t they're, they're never to be seen when the light's shining bright. But as soon as things go dark, those roaches come out. 
oh man, and that fucking it pisses me off. It gets me mad. And, and for those who don't know, uh, <laughs> these people will often have an effect on me on things that uh, are said or whatever after right. things like this happen. And I saw we talked about it earlier. Yeah. There's even like a couple of choice people in, in the Juggalo community that are friends of mine or whatever, and I see them say things. And when they hate on ICP, yeah. uh, it's like fucking oh, it damages and my soul. Happens. You know what I'm saying? It happens. Uh, and today, no. like I see, there was like four people who like. Uh, you know, Psychopath, they've done great ass things. Ouija's doing dough. Big Balls oh, was yeah. like the biggest success. Everyone's talking about it. Even oh, both yeah. nights, everyone's talking about it. And none of these people have said shit. Oh, boom. This yeah, fucking tour gets canceled. Oh, I could have seen that coming a mile away. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, get the fuck out of here. I fucking hate you guys. Dude. Hate it uh, but hey, man. Uh, I, I'm, I'm <laughs> so juggalo that I don't give a fuck if these things happen. And they'll keep happening, and I'm used yeah, to the yeah, fucking yeah. bone that is being delivered because we're juggalos and we get the fucking bone all the time. Yeah, we're so used to uh, it. as long we're as, as Shaggy Two Dope, the fucking trooper, will go stay on the road with Ouija Mac, who is killing the game right now, oh and we'll go see them. Yeah. And at that fucking Ouija Mac show, Shaggy Two Dope. Yep, saving the motherfucking day, bro. It's fucking super boss, saving the motherfucking the day. rescue. You know uh, what I'm saying? So we'll mob up at maybe even both of his shows now and yeah. flex hard as fuck. Uh, Jiggy Fresh. For sure, we'll be Ouija dripping. Uh, I, I, that, when we do the root, that uh, water damage shirt, it was like, I had to give you that because right now your uh, Ouija collection is extensive. You know what I'm saying? So you got to be like, you're going to end up being that uh, Ouija Merchalo who's like, yeah, I remember this drop. I got it. Uh, that water damage drop. Yeah, I got a shirt off that bitch. Yeah, I got that bitch signed. I hooked him up with the uh, water damage shirt. Uh, from, uh, and, uh, from that, saving that for, for the review. review, but you know what I'm saying. So you know he'll be oh, yeah. he'll be Ouija dripping or whatever. But we'll be out there supporting both of them probably at Fucking two shows sauce. for sure. Catch us Saucy. at the Forge still. It'll be January 31st, uh, end of this month. We'll be out of the Forge with Razor uh, Thursday, I believe. Uh, Thursday night, and we'll be lacking in an exclusive uh, uh, interview with Razor that uh, night. Yeah, Finally, having they've been uh, done. Dodging About us. time. They're like hard, bro. Months, because they're, too they're wanted. Trying to fucking uh, they're wanted and they're everybody. trying to tour and they're trying to tour. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So it's hard to be in a uh, if they're in a city too long, the police will find them. I know. You know what I'm saying? So undisclosed location. Yeah, it's gonna be an undisclosed location somewhere in the Joliet area. Uh, and we're gonna go ahead and rock a little interview that, with them. Joliet, yeah. You yeah. know, Jolly. Ho 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 but Jolly. But that'll be going down. <laughs> uh, so look us up there. Really, really Exclusive uh, shit to Maybe Ouija will finally give us some fucking content or whatever, uh, and we'll see what happens, you know what I'm saying? Um, hopefully, I want to do a lot of shows this year, so hopefully I get some booking, because I'm going to try to warm yeah, myself right. up. Hopefully we get our fucking mystery boxes before you Oh, know. bro, we can be dripped, drip, bro. Drip, drop, Dripping. sauce, filling. Um, but that's sauce. coming up, man. Uh, and uh, speaking of uh, Ouija Mac, right now we're still fucking wa uh, riding that water damage flood. Uh, he Surviving. just. Uh, I want, we haven't done our uh, review yet. Right now, we're kind of stalling because we want to have the uh, physical CD there. You know, it just <laughs> makes the shit. You know what I'm saying? Having it, it also shows that we're you know supporting it or whatever. Um, but last night, he dropped. Um, well, actually, it's like 80 1951. years ago. 1951. 1951. This album has resurfaced. Yeah. Uh, this EP mixtape, whatever you want to call and it. I can't pronounce it, but it's it's when, water damage. Yeah, I, looked, I, I held it in the mirror and it says water damage in reverse, uh, but it dropped uh, back or resurfaced back and it's all on all streaming platforms oh, wow. and uh, it's very dope. Um, very, very dope. There's this Dead Body Man track on there that's very dope. Yeah, Dead Body Man 3? Three? Three. Yeah. Three. Yeah. Uh, it's really it's good. Uh, there's a couple other tracks in there that are just dope as fuck, so if you get a minute, check that shit out and keep riding that flood with us, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. uh, we, we talk so much about Ouija Mac in like every one of our shows, uh, for those who don't know. Um, you can, marks you can go awesome. back and you can check out all of our videos, and uh, including our uh, gutter water uh, review. We will be following that up with the water damage plus the fucking uh, water damage reverse um, review will be compiled into one. Um, we kind of have an extensive review, man, because the shit's dope. I'm excited. I'm, I'm Are you doing excited. this review with us, Fuck then? yeah, yeah. Last time it was just uh, Jiggy Fresh and I'm I. Gonna jump uh, up in Matt Murders is going to come into this bitch. Even if he's just rolling me joints the whole time and I'm fucking agreeing on shit, that's what we're going to do, right? Yep. I yep. pearl them like pulls and mm, fucking a champ. He'll pearl them while we sit there and listen to Ouija Mac. And hopefully we'll be dripping then, too, because the plan is to, we ordered the uh, Ouija Mac uh, mystery, mystery box. Boxes. 
Um, and we hope that we could get those around a certain time now so we could unbox those for y'all and do like a quick little video of the unboxing or whatever as a companion video. As a companion video to, or, uh, to the flood, you know what I'm saying? Because it's the flood right now and uh, Ouija Mac is straight killing it. Uh, big shout out to Ouija. Uh, throw us some content, throw us a shout out yeah. at this next show or whatever, you know what I'm saying? Uh, but we do it regardless, yeah, you know what I'm saying? We support who we love regardless, you know? Fuck Ouija just... That man right now, bro. Hell yeah, hell yeah. that motherfucking man. Yeah, yeah, and like I said, for those who don't know, you guys can go back and uh, check out our videos on Midwest United Juggalo, and, uh, you know, we have everything there, and, and, and every one of them we probably mark out on Ouija Mac a little <clears> too hard. <throat> we have some exclusive news also, and I, I kind of, like, I was staggering the exclusive news, but we right. have some exclusive news that we are, uh, one of our homeboys, uh, I, I, gotta, I gotta say it, for those of you who don't know... Our homeboy Logan Swisher <laughs> yeah. had won a contest on our uh, uh, Instagram first, and is uh, now like super tight with us. Um, he delivered us some news exclusively from Big Ballas that we didn't close. report in our last uh, show. Um, or you just told us yesterday. I know, we didn't report in our last show because we didn't have it. True. You know? uh, <laughs> I mean, that was it. That was already one. <laughs> I'm just saying it was close because uh, Big Ballas was still a couple weeks ago now, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Yes, sir. Um, but uh, we got this news, and it's because we were kind of talking about it even earlier today about uh, right around this time last year, they announced the location for DCG Con. Um, ended up being in Colorado. Right now, uh, we're getting word. Word. Exclusively. Exclusive. From, from uh, Jump Steady that uh, they are eyeing up Ohio <coughs> as a potential spot for DCG Con, um, as well as Gathering 20. So we can see what will happen. Uh, there's plenty of places they could do it in Ohio. Uh, I wish it, I wish it was in Ohio, uh, but at the same time, at least Ohio's closer than uh, Colorado. We won't need a plane to get there. We won't need a plane to get there. Yeah. Man, that plane ride was fun, though. The plane ride was fun. Ooh, it was super fun. Well, hey, for those who don't know, we did this cool, <laughs> we did this cool ass shit. Uh, we went to DCG Con uh, last year and. Uh, well, listen to us tell the story of our shenanigans. Uh, it also coincides with how uh, um, MUJ is back together the way that we are right now. So right. Um, if you guys check that out, um, it is back in our back catalog of videos. Um, and, uh, what a fucking trip there was. <laughs> there's some Ooh. fucked up stories in there. Oh, that's that, that's yeah. that DCG kind of shit right there, right? Oh, oh shit. Yeah. Forgot homeboy Look Justin. Uh, forgot his last name, so my bad, but... Yeah, his uncle Scrubby Rag, we got the pins too. Oh uh, yeah, the pins dope as fuck. That shirt's dope. cold blooded. Hell yeah. Pick that up at the con, you know what I'm saying? Eat Monopoly yeah. shit I'll connect for. Some dope shit. Hopefully, my uh, if they do oh, yeah, um, yeah, DCG dope. Con then this year, hopefully uh, you guys will be able to come out for this uh, one now. Yeah. Um, I think that's going to be like, if they do it every year, I think I'm going to try to pop in it every year. I went to the first two now. If they do it this year, I'd like to go. Uh, Gathering Dub is the priority this year for yes. sure. Uh, but any little jug thing in there sprinkled in, I'm, I'm going to try to pop up. And if uh, mm. my fucking Ooh, uh, DCG con's only three, four hours away, then I'm going to fucking go. Yeah, that's the case. Yeah, I'm going to fucking go. And it's winning. Uh, no war, yeah, sure. yeah, I mean, yeah, and it's really easy to get to Ohio. Shit. Most spots of Ohio are easy to fucking get to from here. It's our, they're our neighbor, you know what I'm saying? Right. So, um, But, man, that's speculation right now. Um, if it becomes true... Uh, probably Susan. You heard it here first. Yeah. Uh, you heard it here Just first. Purely uh, speculation at the moment. For those who don't know, <laughs> we've broken a lot of news on uh, the Weekly Wicked Web Show, and this could be one of them right now. Um, so if you are an Ohio juggalo, you might get twice the twice clubs. the here. Yeah. Um, which I, I would have said Kimo. We speculated. We speculated we're that speculated shit. We speculated that it, truth. I think we speculated the truth out of people then too. Look, see, every time that we do a show, <laughs> there's so much shit that happens in the background, and a lot of times it's guns and drugs. <laughs> it's so fucked up. Like, uh, uh, usually when there's a knock on the door, they become a filmed guest. But we're not we're not doing that for this one. You guys, because you guys don't aren't ready for that yet. You know what no. I'm saying? Go follow our page, and then you guys can be ready for the guest that comes in. <laughs> when, we're oh, in the when we're in the studio, and we're uh, we're in the studio, <laughs> cooking up the sauce here. I'll sometimes you know. there's a knock on the door. Usually when that knock on the door, we're like, oh, come sit down. But this time instead they're like, bang bang bang, nigga. You know what I'm saying? Like, all right, go to the back. <laughs> um, just, just go to the, the door. All right. Uh, a new door, man. We um, we have a, a little bit of other news that's going on uh, that we're gonna touch base on before we get to some news. Cause well, fuck that, man. I'm gonna, I'm gonna talk about this shit right here. Yeah. Uh, Cause I got and I gotta start it off with the the tagline of the show. Um, for those who don't know, 
uh, we started as a, a, a social media, social entertainment website a few years back. Um, we shut down the website just due to technical issues and things like that, uh, underfunding for a huge project that we couldn't really afford at the time. Um, well, over the last uh, couple of years, um, we knew that something was gonna. We had the potential for something else. That something was kind of like landed in our hand, in our laps, and we really didn't know what to do with it at the time. And uh, since we have decided to bring uh, Midwest United Juggalos back, we went into full development of our website. Yeah. Um, in our last video, uh, we talked about how we were going to have a developers meeting um, that evening, uh, which was about well, it was last week. Uh, Last Saturday. Yeah, yeah last Saturday, yeah. a week ago today, uh, we sat down with um, who will be the webmaster of MidwestUnitedJuggalos.com, um, and uh, we basically put it together on paper um, what we can expect to be, oh, excuse me, we can expect to be give, uh, delivering you guys over the next uh, several weeks, several months. Um, before the gathering dub, we're hoping to have fully relaunched MidwestUnitedJuggalos.com. Yeah. Uh, for those who don't know, it was a fully functional media uh, entertainment website, um, and we're bringing some exclusive goodies to it this time. Right. I mean, things that, like, we're no longer going to talk about anymore. You have to go back and listen to some of the things that we talked about, but everything that we said that we wanted to do with the website is <laughs> doesn't, it's, like, <laughs> what seemed like some weird... Far off probability. It, it, uh, what, it, it came through some homework. The the like you said, far off probability that now is becoming a fucking real, real reality. Like it's it's like you said, it fell into our lap. We weren't sure what we were gonna do with it. We had all the ideas of what we wanted to do with it, and now it's all it's yeah. fucking coming together. Like, now it's all coming together. Fucking and, puzzle pieces. Uh, Last week Everywhere. we sat down at a meeting and wasn't that meeting kind of like even though we like we've known our homeboy uh, Adam who's gonna be a special guest on our website or on our web show as soon as we get this ball completely like uh, rolled if the ball once the ball's already rolled and it's done its deeds we're gonna bring Adam in to do an interview um, but uh, we had a, a meeting with them last week and I only call it a meeting because even though we were getting together like watch the fight and right. shit uh, we went to Adam's uh, office and it's like. In the command center. It's the command that's center. Multiple screens, dope ass fucking uh, 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 computer that's like the cost of a car. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Um, and then even those two, uh, two thousand dollar whatever those things yeah. were there. Those and then things. he also runs another server for like a game arc and um, this whole like the Netflix of gaming also something that he is. Yeah. Uh, he is this guy's like top of the. Line. Uh, so we sat in there and he like faced us. <laughs> And all that shit was behind him. And we were sitting on his casting couch. On his casting couch. Because he's got a little casting couch in there. So we're sitting there, and he's sitting with us. And he's got his leg folded, and he's got his notebook. And he's just asking us questions, bro. And he's, like, taking notes. You know what I'm saying? He's taking notes. He's asking us what we want, what we can and cannot do, or what is a possibility but might be harder than what we think it is. So, it was seriously fucking dope. Like, yeah, right. it was like, yeah, if you guys caught what, a little bit, we went live for a little bit. From yeah, the we went live. Yeah, from, uh, I was going to say, from the footage that you guys yeah. showed me, from the last, I was like, bro, it's like, yeah, it's like I, it was like, uh, like a California meeting. We had fucking, we were illegally pirating the UFC John Bones <laughs> fight on one screen, and we had three other screens that were showing the possibilities of things we could do. We took a screenshot uh, on the way back machine of our old website during its heyday, I and it we looked at that shit. And we were like, well, I mean, so now he has an idea of the things that we right. did. We kind of explained it from that point on. And we're gonna bring you like, um, for those who don't know, <laughs> we've been uh, we've been taglining this for fucking uh, months now, and it's MUJ and 4K. Yeah. And uh, it was like ultra. I don't even know. If, I, I, I don't. I don't, like, know, I don't know. I don't even know, know what the proper terminology is anymore. <laughs> but we're talking on the high quality MUJ. If you were, if you seen MUJ back the then, and then you see the website now, you're gonna be like, oh shit! It's like us on steroids. It's like us with a facelift. It's us that drink from the fountain of youth, and it's like beautiful. And it's us from one of the little tube TVs. Yeah. To like a seventy inch, eighty inch fucking sharp aquas or ultra four K like IMAX. Diamond. Diamond We're resolution, you know. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> We're coming at like this. Diamond, 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 diamond,
then you're going to start hearing about it. Um, a lot. But right now, I mean, this it's went from paper to already in working order. MidwestUnitedJugglers.com will be here sooner than you guys think, and we're really fucking excited about it. And we hope that everybody who has been with us um, is going to come back to that shit and love it, our chat room and stuff. And those, and those, for those of you who don't know, uh, we will not come back to the but show. We hope you join us also. Yeah, we hope because you join us then it's, too. Uh, yeah, I mean, even even looking back at like he was talking about on the way back machine that he would, do, it didn't have the same graphics that it used to have on there, but everything was, was there, where it was. How at. It was laid everything out. was laid. There was out. even things that I forgot. The poll, I forgot that we did a, yeah, like we, we did the poll week, all we had the a time. Weekly poll. We had our artists of the week. We had yeah, members of the week. Members, we had the forums there. All this the cool forums, shit. And actually, movie nights. Beastmaster was one of the ones on the way back machine. Yeah, was, true. Was, uh, was, 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 was member of the week. Remember, we week, got that yeah. picture, or whatever. I knew he was on that site. You know, he had uh, shared that like thesis he did in college or whatever. You know what I'm saying? We know him. Yeah, but we know him. We've just never met him. Actually, if you watch our DC or my DC Gcon trippy ass video that I made, there's a picture and Beastmaster's standing. I didn't even realize it until like way after, but I was just taking a picture of the cool ass Mario shit. Yeah. And Beastmaster's coming out of there when yeah, I edited up that go. picture and I put it on there. Uh, look that of it. That video was fun. About yeah. from uh, DC Gcon yeah, or whatever. Yeah, yeah. Oh yeah. Um, but man, the website will be. Uh, a fully faceted entertainment. Um, you'll be able to have like your own little fucking profile or whatever, chat room, there's gonna be polls, there's gonna be uh, top music, notch, you know top what I'm saying? Top notch security. Top notch security for sure. Um, and like one of the big things that we've also been, we've always talked about is censorship. Top and like, security of the world. Uh, <laughs> Craig. There will be no like censorship when it, when no, it comes down no. to certain things. Fuck I mean, that. it's basically like. MUJ runs as the world should run. Be a decent human being, and everything will be cool. You know what I'm saying? Uh, our, our website was known for some really cool uh, things that you would never be able to post on any other website before. Um, yeah. But we kept it classy, though. Uh, and it's going to be classy again, though. Uh, we can't wait, man. Uh, just some of the things that have been happening. And now we're in this we're in this private Discord right now. Uh, you know, if you guys use that chat or whatever. If, or for those who don't know <laughs> discord is a uh like a like a private chat type service or whatever and we started <coughs> to keep track of more uh what's keep going on this, yeah. and uh it's just steadily coming along when he tells us things uh, about midwestunitedjugglers.com um it fucking blows my mind you know yeah. that it's happening right, right now and some uh, of the shit i'll be honest with you i have no idea what he's talking about but i trust him what so was much cool as fuck, like, dude, like, he's super fucking smart and technical so everything he's talking about it just it, it blows well, me away because some of it I understand. But some some of like, it, yeah, yeah, some of it I totally right, understand, right. and that's what made me happy is that he uh, for a while he was like, "Oh, you guys did all this? That's what I was. You guys like, did? You guys didn't have a webmaster? I was like, No, no dude. We like we did it all. It. You know, like we we use Ning to be the same format type of you know where it's easy. I mean, doing a website nowadays is easy, drag and drop type shit. You know what I'm right. saying? And that's what that was. And when he told when we told him that that was us that was doing all of it, and that we never really had any contact right with Ning or whatever, he right. was like. Oh, then you guys got this shit, you know? Like, it's yeah. going to be dope. So he is really going to be our tech guy, and then we'll be this, you know what I'm saying? You guys will see Adam occasionally, whether it's... He's also great behind the camera. Yeah. Uh, we wanted yeah. him to do this show since it was a special show. We wanted him to film an audio on this show. But yeah, you, yeah. in the future, he will be doing uh, uh, audio and video on a lot of our web shows. The things nice. that we do directly to the... Like, if you want to do, like... Like crazy ass shit broadcasted directly to the website, and that'd be the only place you'd see it. That's probably where we get away with doing our wrestling shit at. Yeah. So we could use any videos. Um, but then he'll be helping us set things up like that. Uh, we're working with like so much memory. Uh, we're work where our network is running from fiber optic cables. Uh, the server that we'll be connected to has, hasn't been shut down in over six years. Uh, the company started six years ago. So they haven't so shut good. down in six we're years, you know, so and that, I'm, I might even be wrong on that. I, th I think it's been even longer than that, uh, but the server that we're on in particular is has been solid on the fastest internet in the country. Um, we what just can't wait for it, you know what I'm saying? We want to include a lot of people into that. We want to host radio uh, shows off that and all that. Blogs, and um, everything. As we're coming to the Carnival Spirits Network, we hope to involve Carnival Spirits into... Uh, the Midwest. I know they have their own website and stuff, but we'd like to get them maybe doing like a weekly show or a monthly show. Y'all like artwork. Show. You guys are artists. Send yeah. your shit in. There'll be a lot of things yeah. that'll be coming. And yeah. like uh, share your in shit. this show, and I'm sure in a couple other shows as we go forward, we'll mention it here and there, but our full frontal talking about it now is done. 
because it's it's actually in the works now. Yeah. So the snowball we, is ready. We've hyped it up. We've talked about it now. Now it's, it's like yeah, it's yeah. in process. The next thing that we're gonna see is the actual website. Yeah. You know, like Ad, I'm not gonna tell you guys, but the time frame that Adam gave us. Yeah. Uh, I know when you talk to customers, you always give them a farther time. Right. So that when you come through in shorter time, they're like, oh, man, they came through. They told me, you know, six months, but they came in fucking two. You know what I'm saying? So I feel like the time frame that he gave us yeah. is going to be lower than that time. You know what I'm saying? So uh, um, it might be it's going to come sooner or later. We're going to be doing in-house beta testing very soon. And, and until then, we're not talking about shit. It's done. MidwestUnitedJellows.com. That's all you guys need to know. Um, yeah. And we're really excited about that, man. Uh, that's, you know... <clears throat> Just the beginning of things that will be coming in 2019. Uh, for those who don't know, we did a uh, end of the year show and we talked about all of our plans for 2019. Um, in that last video, we were hyping up the name uh, to Jiggy Fresh's upcoming web series. Oh, but he changed the name. Changed the name. He Change Change the name. name. It's much more dope. Now. It's not. It's not perfect pints for G. It's not perfect pints. I've been. No, I no. hashtag. I know. I know. All over the. We place. hashtag that shit all over the place, and he changed it that night because what was, what was it? we came up with much better name. I'm not. I'm not, came through I'm not going no. to. I'm not going to just sit there and drink pints and pints. Yeah, it's going to be much. Beer. It's going to be so much. It's a much much. My plan more is to name. buy the little wooden flight things. You know what I'm saying? You get at a at a brewery at Three Floyds, right? You know what I'm saying? You get a couple of different samples in my little glasses. It's going to be fresh flights. Would you get fresh? Hell yeah. Fresh yeah. flights, completely unique. I don't, I don't want to fucking bomb fresh and no. be smacked before the fucking video is over. Fresh flights. I mean, you can't fresh do uh, we, uh, Perfect Pints. That was the name of a festival in Porter. I think that's why it was stuck yeah. in my head. Yeah. So, yeah, fresh flights with Jiggy Fresh. Fresh fresh flights, man. That's the. That's their trademark. Yeah. Team MUJ presents sticks. Fresh Flights. Yes. Yeah. Sticks, right yeah. 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 sticks with our tongue twist. Maybe you guys will see an episode here, but if not. It's That'll be, be coming to uh, Team MUJ's uh, official uh, YouTube channel, as well as some wrestling content. Wrestling. Um, and then, you know, we hope we do more co uh, collab videos like this throughout the year. Um, mm -hmm. There will also be, um, you know, uh, some reviews coming. Yep. Um, there's going to be some behind-the-scenes footage from the next upcoming shows that we'll be at. Uh, you know, we're just trying to bring content, and uh, as we like to say, go wham for the fam. Wham for the fam. Um, all 2019. Um, we're just gonna go harder than we did last year, or, or even just you know keep the same pace, just doing more things, different things, things like this, things yeah. like this with you guys. Um, for those who don't know, we also like to get together on our Instagram at Team MUJ, <laughs> and we run uh, into the Echo Side live, and uh, we also do Juggalos Against Sanity live. And the other night, New Year's Eve, we had a night size party playing uh, online for us. They were picking the answers and shit, yeah. and, it, and it turned out pretty dope. We actually right. found the, a bird box meme. Did you see that? I did. The, we found a bird box meme in uh, the Juggalos Against Sanity card, which was dope. You guys check that shit out. Share it. Give us love. Because um, we love you. But that's uh, that's something else that we do, and we do that normally on our social media. Um, uh, uh, the most popping social media would be Instagram and Twitter, I would yeah. think, then, right? Yeah, Twitter. Yeah, so you can follow us at both of those at Team MUJ. Um, over the next couple of the weeks, uh, there will be uh, what's going on here? Well, Sunday, uh, tomorrow, actually, uh, if this video. Tomorrow or comes, today. Gets out in time. This video will be out today, which will be tomorrow. So that's today. So today, Sunday, <laughs> January 6th, you can catch Twisted doing their hol holiday hangover weekend at the Alrosa Villa in Columbus, Ohio. Right, I'm going to have to so find the local police that. station for that and call in a bomb this threat. Guy. He ain't really going to be back because Ian J got canceled. And I was telling him today, man. Jesus, I want record. After uh, Ian J got canceled immediately, <coughs> I booked a hotel overlooking Astronomicon's hotel. <laughs> <coughs> and I'm going <coughs> to steadily call him <coughs> emergency <laughs> service. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna steadily call emergency services on Astronomicon and be like, oh, I just saw some guy walking into this hotel with a gun. Oh, I'll send, I'll send 911. Or I'm gonna be like, oh, this guy, this guy just passed out in the hallway and he's vomiting all over himself. Send 911. Oh, well, and then I'm gonna go there, I'm gonna pull the fire alarm and run back to my hotel and I'm gonna fucking record it all. Uh, uh, he's trying to cancel events that came to canceled on like uh, certain tours that got canceled. Yeah, because dude, you know, of the artists. That's the only way I That's can be as salty shit. as these. a lot of these people out there are being salty about it. But anyway. I'm just joking. I'm not really going to do that. He might. 
Uh, <laughs> but man, wait. like I said, we got a bunch of shit coming up. Um, for those who don't know, we do this regularly. Uh, if there's nothing else, what else we got? That's all we had. Uh, oh yeah, we got a little bit of tour. Oh, Stanley we got some tour. Oh, that's an important tour. That is. That is an homie, important tour. Our homie Triple M F D. Triple M F D, motherfucking insane poetry and scum. The fucking gore father in this bitch. When's that shit coming about uh, around? Uh, never. February twenty second. Oh, that's far though. Two in. Yeah. Where's that? Saugat, Illinois. It pops. Oh, it pops. For all you lucky motherfuckers that get shows that pops all the time, that's what's up. I'm glad you guys support that venue because every show fucking. Is it like pops. a fucking twenty four hour venue too? Is it really? I'm pretty sure it pops is like. 24 hours? Yeah, like... I've never been there. I've never been down to Pops or anything, and then, there's been all kinds of shows there. Ask your boy. I'll ask him. Ask your boy. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, all right. Shout ask your boy. Friend. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> hey, hey, I hey, saw this guy in custom gear carrying a gun inside Astronomicon. Let's wait till... <laughs> uh, as soon as Fatal Frankie gets up there, I'm like, ah, uh, what's that car? <laughs> Uh, this there's guy just stashed drugs in this car. I'm gonna describe Fatal Frankie's car like that. Blood. Yes, that's them right there. That's terrible. <laughs> oh, fuck you. Yeah, I'm just joking. Get uh, down. He's got a lighter. We're in Carl's Tavern. We figured out as far. Everybody goes to Carl's Tavern. Also, I guess they got mad love at, at Carl's mm. Tavern. It's um, in New Haven. That's that's the like two so hours away from New Haven. Yeah. Like, and we were talking about it earlier. Like for it's like Fort Wayne ish, and that was like, Fort Wayne's far for us. We might as well go to Indy. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. If something's gonna be in it, because then you could just take 65 straight to Indy instead yeah. of going like these fucking stop yeah, and go highways. 35 uh, stoplights. Um, we do want to cl- uh, get down to Indy though, especially for our boy uh, Torsten and shit. Oh, yeah. Much love. We got a gang over there. Yeah, you know yeah. what I'm saying? Um, got a gang, bitch. If this Axis family tour was somewhere Torsten. close, you know what I'm saying? If fucking big shots was still. Open, they probably would have got it. this, and then I might have went. But I'm not. Go- I fucking hate AMB. Uh, <laughs> Axe really ain't you know worth me going to see. And I, just to go see fucking scum uh, insane poetry, that'd be the only reason. I might buy a ticket over the internet to Carl's Tavern just so that they get paid. But I ain't gonna be there. Um, hopefully we'll it's get some more shit announced. Game. Hopefully there'll be more tour dates announced. Now that E&J got canceled, we really only have uh, Shag's Two Dope locally to look forward to. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, that tour, that's all we really have to look forward to. You know, that kind of sucks. Uh, fucked everything up. But, I mean, it already is January fucking 7th or 5th. Six, six, six. So we got about uh, over Next a month. Week? Oh, for what? Fearless Fred Fury. Oh. So that's all we really have to look forward to besides that right now. And who knows the fucking state of Fearless Fred Fury if... You know, what's up with Violent J or what's up with ICP and That shit should be done by now. Yeah, but what if he's got to just go lock himself up for fucking 90 days in a fucking... Do what you got to do. I don't care what you got to do. It has to... uh, But that album has to drop that fucking day. Friday, February 15th has to drop. Yeah, Yeah. it has to. It has to. Um, Still no news about Juggalo Day also, which is uh, just over a month away. Um... Right now, there's only the one flyer, and then there's that bullshit light show. No, I'm not saying it's bullshit. Love everybody who's throwing out on the show. I'm just saying it's not like psychopathic. It's not like, hey, we're doing this pre-show. It was Juggalos by four Juggalos by Juggalos, yeah. which we totally love. It's, I'm just when I said bullshit, right. I just meant that it sucks that it's not Marty like Raw. I think that's what they're dubbing it. It's not fucking psychopathic promoting the hell out of the show or whatever or putting on the show. Okay. Um, and there's 25 people opening up for light. Um, but hopefully there'll be some news on Juggalo Day soon. Again, whatever's happening on the Z and J cancellation uh, has potential to slow up everything or fuck everything up. Uh, I, I, you know, obviously we hope for the best. Yeah, um, I mean, expect the worst. Whatever, though. whatever hope happens, for the best, expect the it, worst. It, though, it happened man. at like a shitty time. You know yeah. what I'm saying? It, it canceled the tour, and Fearless Fred in the month, Juggalo Day that same weekend, yeah. Fearless Fred drops. It's like, yeah, it's what fine. the hell's going on? Yeah, like, it's too, a lot of shit going down. It's whatever I, I meant to write down the end of what they said in that message, but it was like you know, uh, you know, when we our full dedication to the Juggalos or some shit like yeah. that. Like, and we get it, and that's why you know I'm not gonna just shine or dim out when they're fucking when some bad shit happens. I'm not gonna hate right. too much. Of course, we're gonna say this piece. We're gonna trend, uh, blame Violent J on motherfucking mm-hmm. Twitter and shit all day. You know what I'm saying? Fuck it. Uh, but at, at the end of the day, I hope everything's cool. Um, right. You know, 
It's not like I'm not gonna fucking. Oh fuck it! I didn't even buy tickets to this shit. So it's all good. I didn't buy these tickets to this show. Uh, I even if well, I, I was gonna buy tickets though anyway for sure. Even I don't have to. I was gonna buy tickets and we we're gonna like give them away or if anybody wanted to come, yeah, I was gonna buy tickets. Plan. That was the plan. So we'll have to do that for uh, Queeja Smack and Shaggy Two Dope. Uh, we'll be doing a on the day. Giveaway. On the day giveaway. On the day giveaway. Maybe we'll do that when we go to uh, Indy. Indy too. Indy's yeah. next weekend, right? The thirteenth. I know a guy who's got who has uh, the same tickets then for their discount prices, so we oh. can do without the fees or whatever. Yeah. He's okay. a promoter from Indianapolis. Uh, I have him on my Facebook. We'll talk to him. Same thing that we did like with uh, right. so with uh, Ninja G up in Fort Wayne. Yeah. Shout out Ninja G. All we gotta do is hide some tickets, make him go on a scavenger hunt. Yeah, we'll put them in like. Uh, I, dude, I know the area, actually. I know the area around uh, the Emerson just as well as Joliet. Uh, Michelle's family lives like right by the Emerson. Yeah. So all right. Uh, you, uh, may, you may know some Liquor store, restaurant, spot. Kroger, all right in that area that we could hide the shit dope at, you know what I'm saying? Um, or we could even give them to the, like, we could go eat at this restaurant and give them to the fucking waitress and any juggalo who comes into this fucking restaurant and eats she, she has oh, yeah. to give them to him you know what i'm saying right that'd be something we could do we'll, we'll figure it out but we're gonna give away tickets for probably both events the, uh, indie show. the for or the ford show for sure because i'll get free tickets for it or at least because i'm not paying to get into the show i'll buy a ticket then off my homies and go we'll hide that somewhere there's a lot of cool ass places to hide shit then too oh, yeah. if we do the interview outside of the venue itself Right. We could uh, hide the ticket where we do the interview. Yeah. That'd be dope as fuck. Um, so just be on the lookout uh, uh, for all that coming real soon. You could find all of the information we talked about here um, on our Instagram or Twitter at Team MUJ. Um, really, if you search us on anywhere, you're gonna find us. Even on YouTube, uh, yeah. we have a uh, our, we have our name minus the S yeah. <laughs> on YouTube. It's Midwest United Juggle. Uh, all that information will be yeah, here. It's all be there. Uh, again, we want to thank everybody at Carnival Spirits, yeah. uh, Scotty, fucking Beastmaster, uh, all you guys. What's I, you know, I, cause I thought you know I thought we talked to Don Chaos. I'm pretty sure yeah. we talked to at DCG Con. So shout out to everybody who fucks with them. Uh, I don't know if Roxy Riddlebox, my boy, uh, my son was all hyped because he was telling me that someone subbed our page and he thought it was his page. And he's like, Dad, they're a juggalo. And I was, but it ended up being this person. Oh, I looked at her page. Uh, she follows us now. I'm pretty sure it's Roxy Riddlebox. Uh, much love to uh, right. everybody out there who's watching this shit. Uh, we appreciate you. Come follow us. Uh, and we can do this shit all together, family united, not divided. Oh, yeah. um, again, man, uh, as a motherfucker. one more time, for those of you who don't know, <laughs> I'm Bobby Blaze. Are you fresh? I'm Matt Murderous. We are Midwest United Juggalos, Team MUJ, love, love, or no love, family united, not divided. Yeah. Thank you again, much love. Yeah.